G'day, it's me again. Back with another banger video for my homies. You read the title, you know what you're in for. Let's get into it. Alright, start off with some DVDs because they're on top of the pack for some reason. Everybody hates Chris. Wow, that light is really bad. Look at that. That's awesome. Anyway. Um, everybody hates Chris. I used to really love this show growing up. And it's not streaming anywhere. So, you're out of luck if you want to watch it. So, that's why I bought this. Yeah. The discs are silver. I don't know if that's... Oh, that's that's fun. Um, if you look at it, I haven't watched these yet. You can see it's got the, the episode list on the, the disc. That's cool. I wish more things did that. That's very cool, because if you're looking for a specific episode, you can just find it. That's really cool. Paramount, get your shit together. Put it on Paramount+. Plus. And I got the second season. I just got the first two uh, for now. Oh, there's a big cut on the back of that. That's annoying. Yeah, same thing. It's got the, um, came with this little bit of fabric for some reason. It's got the episode list on the side there, on the side of the disc. That's really cool. I used to really love this show, so I'm excited to watch these. I haven't seen them yet. Um, I hope it's not as bad quality as The Simpsons on DVD, but it's a possibility. I remember DVDs looking pretty bad. I only bought one Blu-ray recently, and it was the Wallace and Gromit 30 Cracking Years Collection. Um, which I don't think is everything. A grand day out, the wrong trousers, a close shave, and a matter of loaf and death. Which I think they're missing the, the were-rabbit one, yeah? Or was that a short, maybe? Is that... I don't know. It's still wrapped. It's still... I haven't even opened it yet. <laughs> uh, well, let's go to the next wrapped one anyway. Um, I'm a big fan of the original Candyman movie. It's it's uh, one of the best horror movies probably ever. So I bought the new one. I've already seen it, so I haven't like been keen on watching it, really. I've never seen it in 4K, though. But yeah, this one's not as good as the original, of course. This is actually one of the good um, 4K Blu-rays. Comes with the the Ultra HD Blu-ray and the regular Blu-ray, which is really nice. I'm a big fan of when they do that. Oh, there's an alternate ending too. I usually, I don't get too into uh, special features. I never did on DVDs or Blu-rays, but I might need to check out that alternate ending. Here's a fun story for you. When I was a kid, my mum, we were... Uh, going on holiday somewhere. I don't remember where, uh, but I wanted to watch the Star Wars movies, uh, one, two, and three, while we were there. Uh, watched the first one, all good, and then I went to watch the second one. She had the wrong disc for it. She grabbed the special features disc, so I was I was watching the uh, special features to that instead of the actual movie. That was um, something. That was kind of fun though, because it gave me like an insight on how they actually made movies and how the kind of the CGI worked for those movies. It was kind of kind of interesting, uh, and I've never I've never watched special features since because I just kind of don't care. <laughs> yeah, these these next three are some of my favorite movies, so I'm I'm kind of excited to to get into it. The Batman in 4K. This is the best Batman movie. <laughs> There, I said it, okay? This is the best Batman movie. I don't care what anyone has to say. And again, the 4K disc and the regular Blu-ray and the special feature disc. That's cool. I like that. I like that. Even if you don't have a 4K player, you can just watch the normal one. That's great, and then once you get a 4K TV, then you can watch the 4K version. And then you can really appreciate how fucking good this movie looks. So good, every shot is just like... So good. So good. Uh, then I got Interstellar, which is one of the best movies of all time. I love Interstellar. 
Oh, that is in there. Okay. Sometimes the disc comes loose in this one. I'm not sure why. It's not broken. Uh, but yeah, Interstellar, great movie. If you haven't seen it, what are you doing? Go watch it. Even just watch it in 1080, it's fine. It's really good. Uh, the worst part about this movie, the switch from IMAX to normal cameras is very noticeable and it's very annoying. Especially since the IMAX looks so crisp and clean in 4K. And then the normal camera is kind of grainy. And it, it's like almost off-putting because it'll go to like this beautiful shot and then it goes to the camera, the normal camera, and I'm like... Oi! And the last 4K Blu-ray that I bought... The Shape of Water. If you haven't seen this movie, it's very strange. <laughs> I love it though, it's 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 such a pretty movie, especially the 4K Blu-ray. I'd seen this in 1080 many years ago when it first came out and I thought it was really good. This 4K Blu-ray, I don't know if it's Ultra HD Premium, whatever that means, premium, but it's gorgeous. This is the best looking movie, I'm serious, this is it. I don't think it's the best movie ever made, but it's the best looking. It's, it's very beautiful to look at. Even when she's fucking the fish man, it's very pretty. But yeah, I, I like this movie a lot. And uh, I thought it was funny, there's um... Michael Shannon and... Oh fuck, what's his name? Fuck, okay, um... Michael Shannon and there's two guys from Boardwalk Empire in this movie. I was like, oh that's fun. I don't think they ever shared a scene in Boardwalk Empire, so now they do. Go watch Boardwalk Empire too. that's really good. But yeah, that's everything I've bought in the last, I think, week and a half or two weeks. So there you go. There's my recent pickups. Some of them better than others. I'm still kind of shocked. Why is The Shape of Water the best looking movie on 4K Blu-ray? <laughs> what is Ultra HD Premium? Is that anything? A am I... Am I out of touch? What is that? That four and a half star from David Stratton is spitting. It is pure magic. Is that it? Oh, fuck, Jesus. Oh, my piss. Don't even fell over. So, yeah, that's going to do it for me today. Hope you enjoy the video. See ya.